I was diagnosed with eczema when I was an infant. I would always desperately try to hide it. With eczema, there is no way you can get away from that itch. We were told by the doctor so much, you know, don't let her scratch, don't let her scratch. There's nothing I can do about it. It's almost like my hands have their own mind. Part of me feels like I do have eczema because my partner does. Even my best of friends turned on me and told me I look like Darth Maul and stuff. It'll mow down your financial life. It'll mow down your professional life. You think that no one's gonna love you. It's not trivial. It's not just a little skin rash. When I hear it's just eczema, I get very, very <laughs> angry. We tried lots of creams, we tried lots of showers, we tried lots of baths, and we tried different foods, we tried different medicines to try and help it. I just remember it, it hurt so much, it started getting worse flare-ups. As parents and, and caregivers, um, it, it, it was always, um, you know, our hope that we could do something to relieve uh, the suffering of our daughter but we often hit brick walls. Sometimes I was like, why isn't there something that can help me yet? Why isn't there something that can at least soothe the pain? You know, I've done everything I could think of, from diets to exercise to drugs, everything. I mean, drugs isn't pharmaceutical drugs. I've done everything and it's still here. I went through five different physicians to get to an answer in this situation. And uh, it has the effect of taking over your whole life. As a, as a first generation Asian American kid, my parents didn't know much English. They just have to trust what the doctor is giving them. And you're just left praying at that point. I said, oh my gosh, there is another side of this and it's not terrible and we're, we're going to grow and we're going to thrive. It was just like, like being a whole new person and trying to figure out how to be a whole new person because eczema had always been with me. What I've learned in this relationship is rather than getting things done because I think it works, ask her what would work for her. And that's been a game changer. The goal really is to just normalize eczema and make it into something that people see. And just the simple having eczema does not make you ugly was something a lot of people needed to hear. At the end of the day, we are way more than our skin. That's how I'd like to leave my impact. And so I just want to be able to give back to the community and make sure that the safe spaces that I was given growing up are given to them as well. It's not just about us, you know, it really is a community and, uh, and an army, an army of, of warriors that can make a big difference uh, in each other's lives. It's very hard to have eczema and yeah, it takes a lot of bravery, bravery to go through it a lot. Like, it took everything from me. It was just amazing when I took it all back. <laughs>